Well, today we got a new project. I'm going to be uh, doing some repair work to my trailer. As soon as I get the truck all out of the way, as it moans and groans and gets all angry. At some point, I need to uh, pull this apart and fix the exhaust manifolds because they leak so bad. But uh, yeah, we got to pull the car trailer out. And I'll just use the tractor to move it around. And then uh, we got to clear the crap off of the top of it and then tear it all apart. So let me see uh, if I can do this without wrecking nothing. Get this truck back into its parking spot. All right, here we are. Uh, I think what I'm going to do is flip it over right here. I'm going to pull it and run it, run it right along the edge of the creek there. Um, and then just flip it over towards me because I think I'll have better control uh, if I pull it towards me. So I'll just pick up on it, you know, pick it up on it with the chain. And then as I bring it, you know, back away from it as I'm pulling it over, um, you know, I might just put it here in the corner, right, kind of right by, back of the uh, tractor. Yeah, that's probably a good spot for it. All right, well, I'll uh, warm up the tractor and we'll get going on this. Yeah, you know, wondering why we're doing this. This is the status of pretty much all the boards on here. It was not, not put together with a pressure treat. So I got to go through and replace everything. I think this side got a couple boards. This, here's a pressure treat from a couple years ago that I put in a regular board. Um, all these tires are shot. Uh, I'm going to actually be uh, replacing, I think. I think I'm gonna to have to replace at least two. This one's really badly dry rotted. It's got a whole big old chunk out of the side of it. Um, and then I think there's one on the other side. It's got a lot of wear. Yeah, this one's almost bald. That one's not really holding air. But yeah, all the uh, these spring brackets are just in bad spots, so we're going to cut them all off once this thing gets flipped. But for now, let's get this uh, rotated over. Now, I didn't think this through very well. I didn't realize quite how uh, heavy that trailer is going to be. As you can see, my back wheels are off the ground. So I did, tried to put some blocks under it, then it promptly rolled off the blocks, which didn't do me any good. And then my next step is uh, putting the floor jack under and pulling the tires off, uh, trying to get the side of the trailer a little lower. So hopefully I can get a better, better bite on it, which seemed to work. Um, and yeah, we had a couple of uh, failures and attempts, and eventually it uh, works out.
Well, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. The cart trailer is on its back. So now the fun part, I gotta pull the axles off and clean up the frame real good. And then we'll uh, start resetting the uh, anchor points. I bought an, uh, a new hanger kit. Because, you know, if you look at all these, these are all like torch cut hangers. So they're not the correct hangers. All the hardware is just crusty as all get out. Not really good welds on it. So it's a good thing that this one came out of service. Um, you know, I, I quit using it because that has a bad tire. And the, it, but now the deck's rotting. And really this is just not, not safe. So we're going to make it right. Uh, I also got to hook up the trailer brakes, which I've never had hooked up, uh, which will make it stop a lot better. And would you look at that? We got a crack in the freaking frame. Lovely. So yeah, I got some I got some work cut out in front of me, um, but that'll about do it for uh, today.